Of course, any, any person who's familiar with American history knows as soon as you unleash the beast, you can't wrap it back up, put it back in its cage. I mean, that shit's going to go out of control. And, and, yeah. This just in, you are looking at a, obviously a very disturbing live shot there. That is the World Trade Center, and we have unconfirmed reports this morning that a plane has crashed. Today, we've had a national tragedy. Uh, two airplanes have crashed into the World Trade Center in an apparent terrorist attack on our country. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good day. Good day. Good night. Good afternoon. Good day. <laughs> The Bush administration will allow National Security Advisor Condoleezza Rice to testify publicly before the 9-11 Commission. For President Bush, it was a dramatic reversal. I've ordered this level of cooperation because I consider it necessary to gain a complete yeah, picture. Understand. And we're going to show you uh, from the West Bank. These are the Palestinian Commission celebrations in the wake of the 9-11 Commission. I look forward to this and answering their questions. Why are we to make it right, Jennifer? Why are we appearing together rather than separately, which was their purpose? Because it's a good chance for both of us to answer questions that the 9-11 Commission is looking forward to asking us, and I'm looking forward to answering from Let's see. We have to have one story, so I'll say part, and if I get it wrong, hedge a little bit and give me the next. I want to thank the chairman and vice chairman for giving us a chance to share views on, a, on, on, a, on different subjects, and they had a lot of good questions, and uh, it was, I'm glad I did it. I'm glad I took the time.